wasn't anything like what they saw in Schenectady this week. Some neighbors in that area say it's the third time this summer they've experienced this sort of flooding. The area is still recovering from downed trees and power lines. And the Weather Authority team tracking cooler temperatures as we inch towards the weekend. I say inch towards the weekend. I declared it was Thursday earlier. That just rolled out. I mean, do I have no idea what day it is? I wasn't trying to mess you up. I know it's Wednesday. Yes, it is. Tomorrow's Thursday. I want it to be don't Thursday. Don't listen to anything I say. I want it to be Thursday and Friday too, Michael. Don't don't worry about that. But uh, as far as the weather goes, we're gonna get the chilliest weather out of the way. If you don't like fall temperatures in the month of September, or at least below average temperatures, we're gonna get it out of the way during the weekdays. And if you love summer, we got that warmth back for the weekend. Take a look here at the graphics. You can see the map here. You know, is it late summer? Is it early fall? Technically. It is still the summer season. We got about another week and a couple days left of it on the calendar. And you know, the fall temperatures will be looks like for Thursday and Friday. So you may very well have to turn your heat back on or you're going to tough it out and just have some extra blankets around the house, the apartment. But look at that Saturday, Sunday, Monday, the humidity is back. The warmth is back. Specific numbers on the 10 day forecast tomorrow high 64 degrees. That's it. And I think most spots will be seeing some sun around, so that's some good news. Maybe some lake effect clouds or sprinkles south and east of Lake Ontario in the morning, low 50. 45 the morning on Friday, 69 that afternoon, maybe a couple morning clouds, lake effect sprinkles once again. The Canine Carnival on Saturday for Wayne Mahar hosting that. 81 looks good, warmer. 82 on Sunday, Monday 77, both those days some Showers, some storms possible, not likely. Overnight lows back in the 60s. We go from 60s as highs back to lows next week. And later on the week into next Thursday when fall begins, temperatures kind of near actually above average. Michael? Thank you, Josh.